Hi everybody and welcome to Mouth the Reverse YouTube channel. My name is Jordan Zerker and today I'm going to be giving some insight on Black Friday shopping. Now I realize this is coming out before the actual event but my hope is that I can give you guys some exciting new ideas and some maybe over exaggerated uh, tips to try out this Black Friday shopping to get you guys prepared for the best deals uh, this holiday season. In my opinion, the best way to get all your holiday shopping done is to get it done early. And I found that Black Friday usually has some great deals. So today I will be going through the Fox Run Mall here in Newington, New Hampshire, and you know, giving you a little scope out of the stores, um, maybe hopping into some of the more popular ones and chatting with some of the staff. Um, I'm just excited to see how this goes, and I hope you guys um, really find something. So um, let's get started, I guess. So even now as I just walk in, I'm already freezing. Um, wow. Oh my gosh, November's cold. Um, <laughs> so I think one thing to really remember is, you know, you've got to dress appropriately. So I have this lovely, lovely um, sweatshirt. And honestly, this might not even be enough. Definitely bring gloves, bring a hat, bring, you know, your snowboarding equipment because it might snow. I don't know. Um, you want your hands free for anything that might come up um, along your path. You know, you could see an item you really want to grab and want to just die for it. And if you have, like, stuff in your hands, you're not going to be able to do that. So definitely um, bring a bag. Also bring some snacks. Right now with me, I have a granola bar. Um, you might even want to bring, like, I don't know, turkey, like, a dinner. You know, oh, leftover turkey because it's the day after Thanksgiving. So um, best buy suggestions. Um, here we go in the store. Here we go! So, I'm already getting some pretty weird looks for my outfit choice, but you know what? This is what you have to put up with anyways. So, um, now that we've kind of established what you need to wear, I would also like to point out something you should do beforehand. Um, right now I'm just walking through the mall, scouting out some of the great stores in the area. And if you're going to do the most successful Black Friday shopping, you want to know exactly where you're going, want to know exactly what you're doing, um, and just be completely ready for it. I'm going to try to find a store now if I can talk to somebody inside and see if um, they have any tips for that store in particular and if they've had any experiences in the past. So let's check it out. So I just entered PacSun because I know my friend Carla was working today and I kind of wanted to see if she had some insight. Oh, look, here's Carla on our Black Friday shopping. Hi, Hi Carla, yeah. how are you doing today? So um, I've been just kind of like giving some advice to people about Black Friday shopping. Have you ever been Black Friday shopping before? Yeah, I have. I've never been in like the middle of the night, but I've been Black Friday shopping. That's awesome. Um, what have you found to be some great tips when you're Black Friday shopping in the past? I mean, there's not always that great deals out there. I guess just be realistic about your expectations. That's really good advice. Free. <laughs> <laughs> Going into a store and thinking everything will be free is yeah. not a good plan. Not everything's 80% off. You have to be ready to pay some money, but I think there are still are some great opportunities yeah, no, to find some cool deals. Um, so I know we're here in PacSun right now. Yeah. Um, are you working Black Friday? I am working on Black Friday. Are you excited? Or are you a little I'm, nervous? I'm excited. I'm a little bit nervous. I've never worked retail Black Friday. My first Black Friday working, I was working at a frozen yogurt shop. Oh my gosh. Which, not the same thing, but technically I worked on Black Friday before. Yeah, I think it's going to be fun. Everyone's going to be working, so it'll be a fun time. Um, a little bit nervous about the customers, how they're going to act, but I think it's going to be fun. I think that the thing that employees hate more than anything are just really rude customers should just throw their clothes all over the floor. I don't know, some advice? Bring pepper spray, be prepared to fight. <laughs> um, just kidding. Um, just be polite. I don't really what else there is. You're just buying clothes. Don't kill someone over a pair of jeans. It's not worth it. Great advice right there. Alright, well thank you Carla. It's been very helpful. So, um, my next thing I would like to just discuss with you all is remembering the objective of our Black Friday day shopping. So for this, I'm gonna take a seat because I've been walking around for a bit and it's been quite exhausting. So let's go back to three important goals. We need to find, we need to obtain, and then we need to buy. So yes, those are my three. You wanna like hit those three to make it successful. I think the best way to do this is to, like I said, scout it out beforehand, which means both in online stuff, in 
the coupon things they send you in the mail and then in the store directly you need to really like do your research beforehand if you want to have a, like a crazy good black friday shopping experience that being said you can totally walk in like day of black friday and like still get great deals i'm not gonna like discount that in the slightest um but i just found in my experience you know the best ways to get those like top-notch deals you gotta like put some effort in beforehand as like that works with everything too so um i think it's ready for me to stand up again i have enough energy so i wanted a little bit of help when i'm trying to get some of these moves for you guys on how to make your black friday shopping a little more successful so i brought in a couple friends um we're gonna first start off with how to get into the stores the fastest this is cam He's uh, quite a bro. He's going to show us today how to do a successful track start. Yes. So, Cam, why don't you just kind of get in position and we'll see. we'll see how this goes. Okay. So, we do not have blocks with us today. So, we'll look at the three-point stance. Ooh. So, for this, we want proper footwear. Sneakers. We want sneakers, yes. We want to get down like this. Find a line you can line yourself up with the best. And then, for maximum force, you lift yourself up and you just go. Look at him go, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> and he's still running. And that's how you're going to get the best deals possible. That's what I'm telling you. You want that big proportion that's going to really just push you in front of all your competitors. So Cam has also offered to show us the wonderful elbow jab. His backpack right here is going to represent the person behind him. So we're running this way. We're getting a nice like lead, but this person's coming up behind us. So Cam's going to turn around. Give it a nice elbow back, and you're gonna knock that competition out of the way to get the best deal. So, one thing I've noticed while being here is that, first of all, the mall's really empty during the week. Never knew that. Um, and second of all, you know, thinking about how, you know, the mall isn't for everybody, and Black Friday especially is not for everybody. And I understand if big, big crowds are just too much. So, I like to present another alternative, which is Cyber Monday. I think. That is such a great opportunity to get some killer deals without um, really doing a whole lot of work. My personal favorite is Amazon, just because they have this thing where every hour or so, new things will cycle through. So, like, one hour there'll be a deal on a GoPro, and then the next hour there'll be a deal on watch, but there's like with thousands of items. So, that's a great one. In all seriousness, I would just like to remind everybody you know, this day is an amazing opportunity for some cool deals and, you know, to save some money on your holiday shopping, but please do not let this day ruin your humanity. This is not worth it. So as funny as my elbow tips are and my the slide tip, you know, it's not, it's not worth it to go all crazy. Have some fun with it. I remember the first time I went Black Friday shopping was with my mom. Um, we were in uh, visiting my relatives, and my mom and I saw an ad in the newspaper, and we're like, what the heck, let's just go. So Thursday after Thanksgiving, my mom and I just went out, and it was a great first look at Cyber, or not Cyber Monday, Black Friday. Um, thank you guys for coming with me on this journey today. It was really fun, also really awkward, walking around the mall with a GoPro, but that's okay. I hope that you guys liked this video. If so, give it a big thumbs up. And maybe I'll do some more of these with different um, fun, exciting days of the year. Also, be sure to check out Mouth of the Rivers website, which is mor.news, and there are a bunch of articles on there. Some of them are even uh, Thanksgiving or holiday related, so also be sure to take a look at those. <laughs> Thanks, guys, and I hope you have a great time Black Friday shopping.